Yeah. My yeah. publicist Christian. will get your information. All right. <laughs> All right. So we got Mia Mal. You're so cute. Oh, thank you. Appreciate yeah, it. You're fine as hell. <laughs> <laughs> if Hercules was in the WWE, who would his biggest rival be? Um. <clears throat> Tell everybody how you have your law degree, too. Yeah. Oh, man, you're... <laughs> Tell this everybody that. About... He's brilliant. He's brilliant. MTV, he's brilliant. As someone who's struggled with addiction myself, you know, um, watching it just hit me in so many places, you know? And I know this is, like, the fourth uh, cinematic version of this movie, and I feel like you you took it to places that the other movies didn't go. Like, what was behind that? I mean, it was just about being, you know, I'm, I'm glad you said that. Fellas, I don't know any other way to describe it, but this movie got me... Stop, man. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, your dad's had a huge career in films. Let's see how well you know your dad's movies. So I'm gonna say a line and then you say the line that comes after, okay? Oh, <clears throat> all right. All right. Can't we just have one night where there ain't no fighting and no one gets shot? <laughs> boys in the hood. Those boys yeah, in the hood. Yeah, yeah, what do you line. say? Uh, shut up, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one. Yeah. But jokes aside, jokes aside. The movie, you know, the themes in it are very timely. Uh, police brutality is just as relevant today as it was back then. Yeah. Do you guys think there's been any progress? So if I say to you, um, you're packed and you're stacked, especially in the back, what would you say? I want to thank your mother for a butt like that. Oh, all right. Can I get some fries with that shake shake? shake booty. Mm -hmm. Oh, to kill you would be an Uzi or a shotgun. Bay. Oh. What's with that thing? I want to know. How does it hit? 